We need to change. We need to push boundaries. We need to to talk to to the new generation. Um, you need to make fashion relevant. What makes me different? Being black in the world of fashion where black uh, color is not uh, so obvious. This at the beginning has been really like part of my big difference and my age as well. Before I was the barman baby, and now barman is my baby, you know. I worked in this office now I think six months, but what is really interesting with this building is that we regrouped everything in one place. I'm on the sixth floor, on the top floor, and it's in a way like I can check everything. I'm obsessed with flamboyance and couture and richness, and I think my office is definitely that. In all my books, I think one that is really important is the Michael Jackson books. I mean, Michael Jackson was definitely the beginning of my interest for the pop culture. I mean, my Bible is my barman book. It can be a French old brand, but it's still connected to young generation. This campaign is really important to me because it was showing love, music, diversity. I don't like dressing celebrities. I like dressing friends. And I think it's interesting when people talk about my star friends because it's not so different than what Monsieur Pierre Balmain was doing. Sometimes I'm sad to hear that I'm just a social media star. You can have 4.6 million followers, doesn't mean that you are not a real designer. When you see the details, all the pieces are so much work, from plastic to um, embroideries, studs, lacing, beating fringes. When people ask me, are you affected by critics and haters and everything? I say, you know, the worst critic that I got when I was a kid in the high school and people were calling me bastard. Obviously, I would say that my background has a huge impact of the person that I am today. Um, I'm adopted. I'm, come from, I'm coming from an orphanage. I don't know my biological parents, which to me, I've always been part of my strengths and I would say my fragility at the same time. Uh, I had the chance to be adopted. And thank God I had parents that taught me values and respect, love, which I think is really the most important thing. If you ask me what is the strength of my life, it's this, my adoption. When I was a kid, I wanted to be perfect because I was so scared that my parents brought me back to the orphanage. And I think I've always been scared to not be loved. So I think that's why I'm always looking for diversity and I'm looking forward to being inclusive in the world. I've built an incredible group of people, which I will call my Batman army. They talk about the pressure of fashion, you know? And I tell you the truth, um, I don't feel it. Me, I feel like freedom. The view of Paris is like incredible. I have my team, which are my friends. I mean, I think I couldn't dream of more.